The man-made disaster in the city of Minamata, Japan, led to the emergence of a disease named after this locality. From 1932 to 1968, which is nearly four decades, the Chiso Company's chemical plant dumped methylmercury into the waters of the bay, whose shore the city stems. The substance entered the bodies of fish and other marine life, which then ended up on the tables of local residents, accumulating in the human body. Methylmercury caused damage to the central nervous system, leading to limb weakness, fatigue, ringing in the ears, and loss of hearing. In especially severe cases, it led to insanity and death. The syndrome, named Minamata disease, was discovered in 1956. But despite this, Chiso continued polluting the bay's waters for another 12 years. Overall, the disease was diagnosed in more than 2,000 people, with more than half of the cases ending in death. However, this figure is not entirely accurate and is likely much higher, as many victims could have died before the disease was identified. Although people and domestic animals cats, dogs, pigs died over 36 years, Chiso and the Kumamoto prefectural government did almost nothing to prevent the epidemic. The impact of the disease on local cats was so severe that the illness was called dancing cat fever. The symptoms that appeared in humans also appeared in cats, but were much more pronounced. The four-legged fluff balls living on the riverbank were seized by a wild fever, and many of them died. Interestingly, after the disease was discovered, the Japanese authorities ordered Chiso to install a purification system. The company complied. A special ceremony was even held to mark the opening of the purification system. Chiso's president, Kiji Yoshioka, even drank a glass of water, supposedly treated through the purification system to demonstrate its safety. However, the factory's wastewater, which the company knew about, still contained mercury and led to Minamata disease. Later research on the disease proved that Chiso knew the installed purification system was completely ineffective and did nothing to remove mercury, having been installed simply as a social measure to appease people. However, the deception was successful, and almost all parties involved in Minamata disease were misled into believing that the factory's wastewater had become safe, leading to numerous problems in subsequent years. Meanwhile, in modern times, Chiso continues its operations, with headquarters in Tokyo and three plants, including one in Minamata. Today, it is a major supplier of liquid crystals used for LCD displays. So, it's quite possible that you are watching this video on a display containing crystals from Chiso. Incidentally, based on this tragedy, there is a film called Minamata, released in 2020, starring Johnny Depp in the lead role. I haven't had a chance to watch it yet, nor did I know about it. If you've seen it, feel free to share your impressions in the comments.